Summertime is normally a busy time for vacations and travel and fun, but with the spread of the coronavirus still playing a major factor in our daily lives, you might change your plan. A lot of people have changed their plans. Our Missouri Capitol Bureau reporter Emily Manley spoke with the Missouri Department of Tourism to find out just how much this pandemic is costing the state. The Show Me State is on track to be in the whole billions of dollars worth of sales revenue due to the lack of tourism because of COVID-19. Since the state fully reopened last month, there has been a steady increase in tourism activity across the state, but it's nowhere near where it normally is. June, July are traditionally two of the peak months for travel in Missouri. The Missouri Department of Tourism is feeling the effects of the pandemic. We have about I believe the number is 82 or 83,000 people in the tourism space that had filed for unemployment between middle of March and, and the last couple of weeks of June. Tourism Department Director Stephen Fouts says compared to a slow decline from a recession, COVID-19 caused a sudden and steep drop in tourism. And this impacted everything from restaurant business and lodging businesses to attractions uh, and convention and event businesses. Compared to last year's third quarter, the state lost more than $317 million in sales revenue from tourism. It's going to be some time before we are back to traditional levels of, of travel and tourism uh, activity in Missouri. Fouts says that's money cities in the state won't be able to recover. Those communities that are really heavily uh, reliant on tourism and that see a lot of convention business or I would say anecdotally the ones that are seeing the greatest impact. Latest research from Tourism Economy shows the state is set to lose more than $3 billion of state revenue from tourism. Last week, when the governor signed the budget for next fiscal year, he also cut $8 million from the Department of Tourism's operating budget. When we have a, a budget reduction, that, again, that impacts, you know, a lot, a, a lot of different areas of our operation, you know, travel, uh, conferences, all, all those kinds of things. Fouts says it's hard to see the light at the end of the tunnel. We don't know what normal is going to be uh, in the next four, five, six months. Now, before the pandemic hit, the tourism industry in Missouri was set to bring in more money this year than in years past. Faust says they're waiting until August to see how much sales revenue was lost to COVID-19. Reporting for our Missouri Capitol Bureau, I'm Emily Manley.